Hey Sagittarius, we're going to see why they're treating you this way. And keep in mind the energies can be vice versa, friend, family, coworker, just anyone around you. Um, so to me, it seems like this person, they're playing with your emotions. That's how they, I don't know, that's how they get, get into your head is through your heart. That's how they control you, I guess. Not that they, they control you, but you know what I mean. Um, they play with your emotions. They could be, I think you have deep roots with whoever this is. Um, I think this person, they come in and out of your life. They're very reckless with your heart, with your emotions, um, with you, period. I think they leave you confused. They leave you in your head, questioning everything. They keep you stressed out. Um, and it's because I feel like you, you, you care for this person. You love this person. You probably were in love with this person and you, some of you may still be. Um, but I think you, either at one time you were very happy with this person or if this person would act right, um, you would be very happy to be with this person, but they're constantly in and out of your life. They leave you hanging. They leave you confused. You don't never know what the hell's going on. They won't ever be honest with you. They never change. Maybe they say they're going to change. They never do once they get their foot back in. Um, it's like they, they're a clown, I'm going to be honest. They go back and forth. They're wishy-washy. They're, you know, they're all over the place. This person could do drugs. They could, they're just very reckless. They're, they're not stable. For some of you, this person, you could be a little bit older than this person. You don't have to be, but they're, you're way more mature than they are. Um, I think they have left you heartbroken. Yeah, some of you could be going through this, but for some reason I'm picking up that this is like an ongoing situation with this person. Um, I think they leave you feeling not good enough. Like you might be, some of you might be feeling like maybe they're not attracted to your personal appearances. I think they make you feel insecure about yourself. Not all, but because it's like, you know, why, why don't they want me like I want them? And so it, it can have you feeling like, is it, why am I not good enough? Is it me? You know, um, uh, so I feel like this person gaslights you. They, it's like they, they try to turn things around on you. I don't know. Um, Maybe you have no closure with this person because they won't open up and be honest about things. But, I mean, the reason they're not going to be honest is because I honestly feel like they don't give a shit if you want my honest opinion. Um, they might just dodge the truth, tiptoe around it. Um, maybe you're, you're deciding to just abandon this whole situation or you know you need to you know so the reason they do this the reason they act like this um you know I feel like this person never really had plans on being with you having a long-term actually relationship and you know it could have left you devastated or you're going through this now you may be still devastated about it because I think you have a lot of feelings for this person and they know you do and the first thing I got in my head is why do they do this and it's because they can because they can I feel like they've always done you like this so it's kind of like they've conditioned you in a sense if that makes sense they have misled you um 
like this person's kind of a narcissist, very heartless. And see, they know you see them as an empress or an emperor, whichever. Some of you, you could have um, children with this person. But I feel like this is someone you grew up with or you've known for a very long time, childhood. But it's like you have this long, um, for some, this history with this person. They know that you're very attracted to them. They're very charming, very, you know, easy on the eye. I'll just say it like that. But I think they're heartless. Um, I think this person's just all about having a good time, you know? Um, they do this because of, because the Ace of Cups, your heart, they know they have your heart, you know, you're, you think the world of this person, even though they're a freaking ugh, nightmare, they know you have this about them because if you didn't, you wouldn't allow this, you know. But I feel like they've conditioned you. It's because you've allowed this person to treat you this way. And so, you know, they only treat us the way we allow them to. Um, but I think that's why. I think this person's very... Uh, I mean, you have the magician beside the Knight of Cups, the Queen of Wands. They just know how to work their magic with you. Um, so... I just, I don't, you know all of this. I feel like there's nothing new that I'm telling you. But other than they do it because they can. And, you know, they're going to keep doing it if you keep allowing it. Now, some of you have put it into it, but I think you need to, I don't know. I think this person just, they toy with you. Um... Let me see, what does Sage need to do about this situation? Well, you need to no longer play into their tactics. Don't keep falling for this, you know? Don't be a fool. Don't blindly, you know, you know what I mean. Just, you, you can't give in to this person, no matter. Okay, what's, what should Sagittarius do? regarding this person. I mean, Four of Cups reversed, Eight of Wands reversed. I just feel like you should block this person. Don't talk to them because all it is is drama. Drama, chaos. I think it just causes a lot of stress on you, worry. Um, wow, yeah. Moving on, no new beginnings. Um, just leave this person alone because, and I feel like too, this is someone that you can't even argue with um, because they're never wrong. You know, four of wands, reverse, ten of swords, like, just be done. Stay away from this person. Um, wow. They're the queen of wands, reversed. I mean, I think you should avoid this person, block this person, because they're going to keep doing it as long as you allow it. Um, so, anyway... That's what I have for you, Sagittarius. See you in the next one.